Hello guys and welcome back to another video. Today I'll be uh, playing Minecraft, but today I'll be I've actually created a song using a Minecraft Noteblock Studio app. Uh, and actually it will be an existing song from the movie called Sound of Music. But without further ado, let's go right into the music. So let me just place my Minecraft right here and so now we're going to start the music. Cue. my song was just a single loop. I could technically turn the loop on and also let me just actually turn I don't know I think I want to turn off most of the sound I like actually I'm just going to turn off all the sound except for the juke no block because it seems that uh, I can't hear a single thing and let us now hear it the second time with a loop and I also forgot to mention but it's actually a mini roller coaster. It's not interesting but I just so yeah as you can see that they have this thing where you can continuously loop this back and yeah so yeah that was my song in a roller coaster mode obviously I if I actually I don't know if this works I haven't tested this so basically I use detector rails or as a as in a way kind of a regular rail at the same time will kind of power the power rail in between so that I can continuously move. Which kind of works, so yeah. And let, let's just get to the end. So yeah, that's the end of this. And let me just go back to, into creative mode since I don't need to do that much. Yeah, and this one I just wanted to test out if I could just make a loop because in in the original build it's a, the rail actually just ends like well not like that obviously but it ends like that. And then obviously it has no kind of in between, just starts like that. So I, I just wanted to make it a, kind of a interesting and have this kind of, in a way, uh, a loop. And I tested it, and that's why I was able to create this roller coaster, which can be looped infinitely. But yeah, uh, let's actually end. And that's all that I have shown. Uh, I have to show. Uh, 
I'm I'm actually thinking of do, possibly doing a tutorial if it's needed. I mean, there is actually quite a bit of tutorial, but they don't have a full tutorial on how to get this onto the Minecraft other than you have to download both that studio app and MC Edit, which I couldn't get to do. I, I wasn't able to do easily. You can there's a way actually you could do it using Minecraft the, the studio and using a mod that is really known that's called the uh, world edit. Perhaps I'll show it in my next episode. I mean not my next episode, this is not an episode, but next video. But thank you guys for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Also, it's, this one was more of a test-ish of how I could use this in my future videos. But yeah, see you guys in the next video. Bye!